Hey YouTube, it's Brandon, Brandon Swisscraft. Today we're going to be going over my belt kit. This guy right here. More specifically, we're going to be going over the contents of what's in this leather pouch. So let's get to it. Hope you enjoy. Here's all the components of my belt kit. We'll take a quick look at each of these items and then we'll take an in-depth look at what's in that leather pouch there. Stay with me. I carry a small handgun. This is a 9mm. It's a Smith & Wesson model 3913. The purpose of this is mainly for self protection. I also carry an extra clip for the 9mm. Next we have the Leatherman TTI charge with some goodies in that sheath over there. Of course you've got to have a Baco Laplander. And then we have the PLSK-1, an associated sphere point. And within that sphere point right here, we have a box knife blade which is meant for more intricate tasks. And also on the, on the sphere point, right up here, there's enough quarters to attach that sphere point to a long stick. And then we have this leather pouch right here, which is packed full of a fire kit and some other odds and ends. Now let's get to the leather pouch. Here's a close-up of the leather pouch. As you can see, it's not much bigger than my hand. If you're familiar with the 10 C's of survivability, this belt kit encompasses that and then some. Let's open up this leather pouch, see what's inside of it. Alright, let's get into it. We've got a piece of candy, get a little, little sugar boost if needed, we got some cordage, right here we have some sugar again for an energy boost, we got some Advil, extra batteries, because we've got this little flashlight in there a little bit of fat wood start fires quick tenders for fire we have a birthday candle we have rock salt right there some more cordage some more cordage we got a multivitamin And right here, take this little rubber band off. Got a little mini compass. Got some matches. Have a little straw right there. And within that straw are some needles. Got some orange cargo tape, water purification tablets, more water purification tablets, We've got a pencil, some more cordage. got a whistle for signaling then we've got a lighter chicken bouillon also for a slight energy boost it tastes pretty good also right there are some small safety pins so I'm going to move all this stuff out of the way and I'm going to get to the other contents within this pouch. Give me one sec. And we've got water purification tablets. I believe we're up to six now. Right here we have some upholstery thread and within that upholstery thread there's some char cloth. 
we got a bolt right there with a weed nun attached to it. I'll get to that in a second, what that's used for. We got some more quick tenders. And within this, there's also a small striker and ferrule rod. Got a safety pin, fairly large one. We have another one in here somewhere. And then we've got the small saw. Now you can buy these and they have a rivet right here. But what I did is I drilled that out. And then one got one of these small bolts and a weed nut. So you can take the blade in and out right there. There's a, it's a multi-purpose blade for metal and wood. And then right here, I'm not going to take the tape off of it. But it's a very aggressive cutting blade for wood. And we've got some more cordage. Vaseline and cotton ball. We've got the other clothespin. We've got a signal mirror. We've got a slingshot band. Got a small fishing kit. There's just some weights in there. A couple different lures. Just an assortment of things to hopefully help catch some fish. And then right here, we've got an aqua pouch. It's a one liter aqua pouch. Again, I'm going to clear this stuff out of the way and finish showing you what's in this leather pouch. So here we have a small foil bread pan squashed down. And within that there is some heavy duty foil. Got an emergency poncho. Space blanket. And then a Fresno lens. And we got some emergency right there just one package I'm gonna move this stuff out of, out of the way once more and we'll finish showing you what's in this we got some jute twine a little bit of wire some fishing line Got a razor blade. And I would suggest, I'm not going to show you this because it has my info on it, but a piece of paper like this with your name and any emergency contacts that you may have in case something goes wrong. And right here. Got a bright yellow bandana. Another piece of fabric used for filtering stuff or carrying whatever you need. One small trash bag. And we've got three ranger bands used for fire or tying stuff together. All sorts of options there. You got something to clean you up. And alcohol swab. And last and not least, small bit of wax paper. Oh, I was wrong. We got that small piece of wax paper. And then just some bright in the rain pages. In case you need to make some notes or something. So now I'm going to give you a overhead view of all the stuff laid out. So here's all the items laid out. As you can see we've got a lot of stuff in that small leather pouch. 
Hope this gives you some ideas. And thanks for watching. Always remember, the prepared mind is the living mind. Catch you on the next one.